Start game. So I am not good at this game. I know very, very little. Um, so, um, so I can get a lot of different equipment. Since I haven't played the game that much, there's a lot of things that I need to learn. Um, but I have played it before. It was was a, a bit of time ago. I'm gonna do beginner because I'm a I'm a baby, uh, and I'm just gonna do. This one I've done before, so I would be comfortable doing that one. But basically, it's a game that's a lot voice mod, <laughs> I bet. The Echo? At the moment, there's no Echo on. If there is, it's Remnants. Um, there shouldn't be any Echoing on now, because I don't have any effects on at all. But welcome in, people! Okay, so, this is the Camper. Does absolutely nothing, but is there. And, so yeah, you can sprint forward, but if you, if you sort of... You know, try to go and strafe. You can't sprint and strafe. We have a lot of equipment, and I think I'm going to go for some... Um, you. So another thing they need to fix is... Um, it's kind of annoying that you have to... That you have to crouch, because it says E, but you can't pick it up. So there's a lot of things, but they are on it. Uh, the development team is great. And they're working hard on actually getting stuff done as, you know, fast as possible. Ah. Oh, yeah, I have to get used to how these doors work. Fuck. Okay, 4.4. This is a very cold house. Not gonna lie, this is a very cold house. So I don't remember if I have to turn on power to get heat, but I'm just going to see if... Because I know there is, like, a... Okay, it's getting colder. There is a breaker box. I know that. How freaking close do I have to be? Oh, right. Push the lever! In that case, it shouldn't say E on all of that. It should just... Yeah. I have a, I have a ton of uh, change suggestions that I would love for them to do, especially if you are going into the journal. Uh, I think it's tap. Which one is journal? It's N. If you press escape now, you go out of the journal. Uh, I usually use escape for that, so that the fact that that works is great. But one thing that they have done that I don't like is that they have an animation when you press escape. And now the menu is ready. So... The menu is not instant, because it has to do this, and then you can use it. So, you have to wait for this uh, animation. I think that is something that you just need to part with. I don't think that that brings any good to the game. It's it's a neato feature, um, just to display that it can be done, and and that is a choice that they made. But honestly... It is very unnecessary. That's personal opinion, obviously. So right here, it drops a lot. Let's see if we can find something. Are you here? Are you here? Are you here? Oh. So we got EMF 5 right here. And evidence, EMF 5. So as you can see, it 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 is kind of like Faz in a lot of aspects of the game, and I don't know if this is gonna be freezing, but it could just go and be freezing at a certain point. Oh, I actually want this. Ah, come on. Is it that button? Nope. Oh, turn on the power. Oh, there we go. Okay, so... Let's see if we can find fingers. There's nothing so far. It has... Touched the lights. So, nothing there right now. But we do have the MF5. I currently ha don't have that high a level yet. So, I can't do the... Uh, the Rite of Exile. And basically, in this game, you have to get rid of the ghost. In Phasmo, you go in and you find out what the ghost is, and you 
pretty much just yeet your ass. In this one, we actually have to find out what is going on with this ghost. Like, what is it? Oh yeah, another thing. Can't pick up until I cycle to an empty slot. That is also a bit of an annoying thing. Um, but you know, it's it's not the biggest thing, but it is a quality of life upgrade that I would wish that they would, you know, go ahead and, and do. Wait a mo. I hear footsteps. Is that my own footsteps? Yes. Okay. So the footsteps is not perfectly timed either. There we go. Okay. So if that one lights up red. Yeah, that's me. Okay. So it doesn't light up red. Okay, so let's see what we can find. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, haze. We got haze. Nice. Noise. So it's a Kijo. That's basically it. Because this could... Like, this game has a lot of potential. Like, a lot, a lot, a lot of potential. Okay, so basically you need to do this thing where you make this make this ritual. It is going to fill up this little, little table tray thing with all the ritual items. And depending on what kind of ritual you need to do, um, it will tell what items you need to do. So, uh, need to have. So this one, because it's a Kijo, it is the Sacred Rite of Derret. And it is... Then there's some sigils, some seals, if you want... To do those, those can protect you. It can make the ghost weaker. Um, it can, um, um, it can uh, prevent hunts and you know other stuff like that. But basically, uh, right, uh, ritual of right, uh, sorry, ritual of exile. You will have a book, and you will have to go and find the specific ritual for that specific ghost. And it just told us what it was. So you go in in the book, and I don't have that because you can't get that before level five, and also it's pretty damn expensive. Uh, but it's going to tell you what you need, like you might need a rune, you might need some candles, um, and then you need a spray paint a bottle, like a rattle can, and you have to make a symbol, then you put on the lights and stuff, and then you have to uh, recite some words to basically tell it to yeet itself. Um, he is easy mode when it comes to dick spirit. Yes, yes, I am. I am. I'm, I'm such a little bitch. <laughs> um, so, and after that, you know, you put the ghost into a portal, and as soon as the ghost is in the portal, you say close, 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 until it is fully closed. Um, it might take several tries. Also, the... Um, the, the speech detect de detection in this game is not the best. I kind of want to see, like, does the Kijo work on Spirit Box? Because I kind of want to try it out. Kijo. Kijo, Kijo, Kijo. Nope. Yay. Um, but the text-to-speech thing, or at least it's the speech detection thing, is a bit wonky. Um... So sometimes you would have to repeat the same thing over and over and over. But bear in mind that this game is only four months old. It is in early access. It is in uh, fast development. But they did release this maybe to some people's taste a bit too early. I don't think so. A, a game in early access does not have to be perfect. It doesn't even have to be very, very, very well functioning. Because it, early access sort of serves the media of you getting to look at a project and not only do you get to look at it because they could just make it make a video you also get to play it and that is cool and that is also how they get you know the, the main part of their input determine ghost type done perform ritual can't do have a ghost blow out a candle can't do remain calm in a closet huh reach zero sanity not gonna do that uh i think i think we're done i think we're done how do we get home? How to get home? I don't know. Oh, right here. Complete hunt. 
Oh, I hold it in. Aha. So I'm still learning. Um, right Ghost did not exile, but I knew that. 